One of the surefire ways to understand how plants will grow in your urban space is by knowing how much light they're going to receive. How much light your urban space gets and what direction it comes from are two things you need to establish before you bring any plants into your new garden. It sounds complicated, but really it's not. One of the ways you can work out where the light is coming from is by using the Compass app on your phone. If you take the Compass app and point it in the direction that your balcony, roof terrace or window box is facing, you'll get a pretty good measure of where the light is coming from. If your urban space faces west or north, the light won't be as strong as if it faces south or east. The other things that can affect how much light you get is your surroundings. You might be living in a built-up area where there's huge tower blocks next to your balcony or indeed in a basement flat where you're only getting a little bit of light for some part of the day or in an east-facing high-up balcony that gets exposed light all day. Either's fine, there are plants that will thrive in shade and plants that love the sun and that means there's plenty of options for you to play with. But if you try and put a plant that's not suited to your light levels into your urban garden, it just won't be happy. For instance, these shade lovers, we've got a fern here and a heuchera, they will both grow happily in the dappled shade under trees or in woodland environments. If you put those into a spot that's very exposed and very sunny, they're just going to fry, they're not going to be happy. Similarly, if you take this grass, which is really good in sunny, bright, warm conditions, it will be really miserable in a shadier spot. By making sure you know where the light is coming from and how many hours a day you're going to get it, that can help you narrow down the choice of plants which will thrive in your urban garden. In the next lesson, we'll be going through watering, another staple of making sure your urban garden thrives.